What's going on, YouTube? It's your host, once again, Crazy Squid, and I'm back with another Amiibo training video. And this is the second time I'm recording this? Not tonight, granted, but I tried to record this a couple days ago when I was doing the um, Tyrant training video, but then somebody called two times in a row in the middle of me recording the video, and I was in the living room where the phone is, so it's really, really, really loud in there, and then it says call from, and then whatever the hell the name is, right next to my face. So, uh, I kind of scrapped that one, but the only thing that sucked was I was already halfway through. I'm curious to see how much, if anything, he's learned, because if he's really, really good at the beginning of this, I know why, and I think I'm going to start, if this is the case, where he still learns stuff, because I already fought him in a match already, and he stage spiked me with his up B. And that scared the crap out of me. But anyway, without too much further ado, we're going to be training a Lucario amiibo. So, I already named him. I, I think I'm going to probably go with this one for now, just because I still don't know for sure if I want to make him like the gray one, or this fancy purple and orangey chested one. I'm not 100% sure yet. I'm just going to go with him for now. But his name's Anubis, based off the Egyptian god. Uh, I think, if I remember correctly, he's the Egyptian god of the dead, if I remember right. But anyway, uh, I'm gonna get right into it. I'm already doing faster than I did in the last recording of this. So, in the last recording that I tried to do for this, uh, I hit him really, really hard with a side smash, and my capture card froze. So it was mid-explosion and the, split, the screen and the stage split into like two separate pieces. It was on this stage, ironically, so I'm hoping it doesn't do it again. But, that was weird. But, uh, yeah. As I was saying earlier, I fought him once in the, like, second filming, I guess you could say, of the training video for him. And in the first video that I did on... I think it was like either Monday or Tuesday when I trained Tyrant, and I put him up on Wednesday. But it was like... I fought him in this up until like level, I think it was like 30 or something like that. I, I completely forgot who I was. <laughs> so the fact that he's already dodged as much as he is, is already an interesting sign, because he did not dodge like this at all the first time I fought him. I also didn't guard the ledge like that, which is kind of interesting. But like I was saying before, I think I've learned something weird about Amigos, that even if you don't save them, save them, I think they still get something from whatever fights they do. Which is a little bit weird to me. Cause that, that's the whole thing with not saving them, I thought. Was if you don't save them, they don't remember anything. Is how I thought it was, at least. Apparently I was wrong. He's gonna do a lot more damage than he should be. How are you still alive? Oh, that hurt. Also, this is a really weird hitbox. What? <laughs> okay, that killed me at like 30. Excuse me? But anyway, I think the Amiibos actually somehow still learn even if you don't save them, which is weird. Because, again, the first match that I fought him in, in the second recording, was an easy fucking stage spike off of him. He escaped it. Interesting. I 
so he doesn't use the counter in the first couple times I fought him either. So I think they do actually learn stuff. <sighs> Which is honestly kind of horrifying. If he can learn that he can hit people, that could be a very entertaining thing worth training later on. Look how fucking fast Zucario is though, like, oh my god. My character didn't even hit the ground, it just died. I really want to teach him how to fucking capitalize on that freaking speed boost of his. Thing. I mean, that's what keeps bugging me out with his fucking final smash. And he got to a higher level this time. Last time he only got to 10. In the first match, I should say. I... Judging by what I've been seeing, at least, from him having to have a series restart like two or three times, I might start shutting off the learning ability for my Amiibos, because I don't want them learning bad things. As dumb as that sounds, I don't want them learning things that will make them even dumber than they are. So, like, as an example with Dayanea, she started using her Uppy a lot, just randomly in the middle of the stage, I don't really know why. But, at the same time, she also started using her Spike Ball, which is why I'm kind of confused by that kind of stuff. But, like, with Gunter as an example, he'll go completely dumb sometimes, and I won't, be, I won't know what the hell to do with him. But then other times, he's like, Tippity tip top shape, doesn't matter what the hell you do to him, he's gonna kick your ass. It's just, it's weird. I'm. I think I might try turning off learning to see if they keep their, like, tendencies better. But I have no idea whether or not I'd actually plan on doing that yet. I was honestly kind of surprised Pete did the freaking Pichu Brothers idea. Because we talked about that like a good 
two months ago when they announced that those computers were coming out for the next wave. But I didn't think he was actually going to go through with it, especially considering he only pre-ordered the one, as far as I know. But I'm... Honestly, I'm not surprised. I can't really say that I'm super surprised. Just because... It was an idea that Pete was really, really wanting to do. I can understand that. That was literally me with the cat room thing. There was no, like, my character went to the bottom of the stage and bounced off of it, and then went weird. It was just, from where I was floating in the beam, it did that. that I get is going to be my freaking day and a style thing. It's going to be like the first thing I can get a chance to train off the train it. The fact that he's already doing a decent amount of damage is always welcome. Let's see here. 
thought that was a freaking Pokemon thing. I bugged out really hard because I cracked it as Castle. Uh, I need to look up. This is what happens when I record at midnight. Oh god. Why we keep moving? Um. Uh, I think this one changes? I'm going to leave it like that, because I don't know. I think that one changes, though. Oh, I'm really excited to do a Lucario training video, finally. But, like, there are a few that I need to finish up, though. I need to finish up Peel and finish up All Might. I need to go back and redo fucking like, Heat Ball. And. Uh, you know, it's Mars and still. Why are you so good right now? I wanted to bait him into it. Okay, then I guess we've started. doing that more recently, and I haven't been touching the other freaking joysticks, but it keeps putting in, like, one of the smash attack inputs. But, I'll be fair, I'm not sure if it's that, or if it's, like, the side of my hand is hitting the stupid thing. Slow-moving kill, though, I'll be fair. Didn't kill. 
I got fucking lucky on that one. That was really fucking lucky, honestly. Uh, depending on how long this next one takes, I'll do what? At least I'll do either one more after this, or I'm gonna stop for that. I don't have to be sure. Well, it depends how long this next one takes. Ah. Here's the other place I was looking for. Hollow oh, Sleep. I was say, I'm like. Where the fuck did the Colossus League stage go? Well, I couldn't find it for the longest fucking time. I was like, yeah, it's beyond something. And then I fucked up with Dracula's castle. Oops. Uh, I should be using something. Hey! Yeah, honestly, like I was saying before about the stats, leave comments down what you guys think below. Uh, again, there's always this experimentation thing that I plan on doing. But I am really curious to see what I can do with him, being completely genuine. There's no way I have like a basic idea of what I could do. There's a lot of stupid crap I could do with him, and I honestly have no idea which way I want to go with him. Oh, you're so 
Sir. That is a really hard one to try to dodge. Well, he beat me. What level he get to? Okay, so he's almost level 30. He did like 100 and, eh, 123 more damage. That's pretty good, considering he's not even gotten equipment yet. Um, hmm. Well. That's Anubis. Anubis is... Hmm. He's definitely an interesting Amoeba. The real question comes into play as to what I actually want to try to fucking give this guy. But, for now, I think we'll leave him just as is like normal. He's enthusiastic, which is always a good thing. Uh, enthusiastic Eagles, from what I've seen at least, tend to learn more when they're enthusiastic, I should say, while they're leveling up, uh, versus some other rebels which have different typing, like, I think Tyrant's gonna be a weird one just because he's already an aggressive Mebo, but, again, that could just be because of the rushdown tactic I kept doing with Ganon, the whole get your people's faces, hurt them really quick, and then try to get them off stage, just go for a spike or something stupid. Um, but, as of right now, this is Anubis. Uh, planned on doing them earlier in the week, uh, didn't really work out because of the whole phone calls in the middle of me fucking recording thing. I don't edit my videos, the most I do is make a fucking, uh, thumbnail for it. And that's only because Pete showed me an app that I can do it on my phone and it's easy as shit. Um, but yeah, I think that's about it for the video, guys. If you like the video, leave a like. If you really like this kind of video and you want to see more, uh, subscribe. Hit the bell if you want to get notified whenever I post stuff like this, though you can watch it whenever you get a chance as soon as you, and get notified as soon as I upload it. Uh, I might do something stream-wise later on. Uh, don't know when. Uh, probably in the next couple of weeks. Uh, there's a couple of games that I'm debating. I might do Minecraft streaming. Like, if Pete and I do a Minecraft uh, playthrough or something like that again, or play Minecraft in general again. I might record my point of view and him do his point of view kind of thing. Uh, I might do... I don't know, I might stream... Uh, I don't know. Maybe some of Knack 2, because I haven't done that yet. Uh, I don't know. Leave comments down below what you guys want me to stream. Uh, I'm up to pretty much anything that's on PS4, just because PS4 is easy as hell to stream from, because they let me do it on the console. Thank fuck for Sony being able that nice to us. I, I really hope they do that again in the PS5. That is, like, the best feature for me right now. It's just the easy stream. But anyway, leaving the links in the bottom of my description, like always, for Ghost and Peach, uh, Ghost and Mike's... Eh, Ghost, Pitor, a.k.a and Venus Mike in my description, like always, 
And that's about it for the video, guys. Thank you all for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one.